Well, free experience. Almost level 23 already. Then I gotta do the revolver parts. And then I got uh, fuel pipe valves. Hello, welcome back. Which Borderlands is this? This is the first one. Yes. What did you miss? We just fought um one of these big alien Seraph creature things. They're pretty cool. I will not lie. And I have maxed out uh, movement speed, which is also cool. And things ignite more, at least more often. All right, got to go back over there. But first, let's do the scavenger hunt on the revolver, because I need a good revolver. Level 19, so funny. You're so silly. It's free real estate, you know? Some Dr. Phil Joe jokes? Oh, absolutely. I'm waiting for Dr. Phil and JoJo to make a comeback or a return. All right. Let's grab our parts for the uh, revolver now. I know there are a few scattered around here. You got this one. I know it doesn't even matter if I have this thing highlighted. Yeet. Because they're all just everywhere, and I don't know if I'll be able to find all of them. Oh! Wait, what? I was supposed to get in there. Oh! Let me add a checkpoint here. Okay, maybe the checkpoint won't go off. Maybe it will. There we go. Nope, nothing in there. Anything else? They wouldn't be mean and put them in these chests. Stay life jacket, exactly. Stay life jacket. So I gotta get up on these rocks and go inside that little caged area thing, I think. Man, I can't Skyrim my way through this. Jumping is so weird. Is I supposed to do that? Oh, I closed one valve. Okay. Well, there should be another revolver part around here. Maybe. Maybe. Continue the chain. Is there a chain? It's like a chain of memories. Dude, how am I supposed to get out of here? Game. This game, man. Where's that other revolver piece then? It's probably going to be somewhere obviously stupid that I just didn't even bother to look. My guess is that it's... Yep. Know it. All right, there's one, and now we gotta close the rest of these valves. And then we turn in the bounties, and then we go to New Haven. I think that's the next spot. I don't know. Am I 100%ing this game? Maybe. Who knows? Honestly? Might just be a bad decision. Also, stay life jacket. Oh, that is the edge of map. <laughs> I should not, not go off that ledge. Can I bring my thing in here. Okay, maybe I can't. There's an invisible wall. Gotcha. Yeet. See you. They can't see me. I'm sorry. Were you fighting me? They really can't do anything against me. I literally just have straight up fire coming out of my body. I am literally the fire hawk. It's like, you can 
try if you really want. Wow, that movement speed is pretty swift. I'll take it. Last valve, and then we turn in our stuff, and then we uh, move on with our lives. To the New Haven, whichever New Haven that might be. And we get a ton of XP, which is fun. Boop, what's up, dude? Easy. All right, turning on the bounty board, and then I gotta go and see the other dude to turn in my Skagzilla thing. Also, I'm gonna make this jump. Yeet. That was a cool jump. Jump, jump, jump. Same thing, I don't know, I can't talk. <laughs> Sledge doesn't like me, you know? Oh, look at that. More Firehawk. More Phoenix stuff. And now I gotta return to what's-his-face. What's his name? Ernest? Ernie? Ernest? Honest? <laughs> I don't know his name. What did you miss? Not really much. I'm just still playing Boaterlands. I think I'm gonna call that that from now on, Boaterlands instead of Borderlands. You got Spider-Man and then you have Spooderman. I remember those videos as a kid. Or like early, late teen thing. Spooderman. I remember when I thought that stuff was actually funny. It's Kitty! Hello Kitty, how you doing? How are the wife and kids? Which for me and you both, it's probably cats. How are the cats? And how are you? It's been a hot minute since I've talked to you. Things have been super, super busy. But you know what? Just vibing. What is this? The fire rate is 0.6. Jesus. That's insane. Also, I should totally sell some of this stuff before my backpack gets full. Shock rubberized. What do I have now? Oh, the transfusion grenades. Yeah, I'm going to keep the transfusion. Fuck that. I'm going to sell my stuff. Um, Desert Masher? Ooh, I'll hold on to that. Ruthless, don't need it. Malevolent, nah, I'm good. Repeater, nah, I'm good. Launcher, hold on to that. Hold on to that. Eh, get rid of it. Explosive? Um, I'll hold on to it just in case I need to do explosive damage randomly. I have a job interview tomorrow. Super stressed. Oh my god, congrats! Best of luck to you on that. I know interviews are very, very hard at times. Especially now with what people require for not interviews, but just, uh, just what they're looking for in people or employees. But still, best of luck to you. I know you'll do great. Or I know, at the very least, you'll do the best you can. And that is sometimes all you can do. But honestly, I'm pratty. And I think we took care of all the bounties in this area, so we never have to come back here again. God forbid the fast travel works, you know? And we just have to make it to New Haven and finish up stuff. And we're already level 23. I think we're way ahead of, like, the, uh... Just the level disadvantage. I know that the final boss, at least in the main story, is around, I think, 32, 33-ish. So we're kind of on the right track, knowing we literally just started the story. Which, I don't know how long the story is in this game. Personally. But you know what? I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying it for what it's worth. Fighting bandits, I think, uh, bandits are pretty cool. Not really. What's this? I feel like this is an area with enemies. I 
because there's too much grass here. I don't know, man. Whenever you think... Is that clap? Do we have to talk to him? I don't know. Ah! Hi. I'm Wagon. Oh, New Haven. I sort of remember this area a little bit from my Borderlands 1 playthrough. I'm transmitting to inform you that I've made a decision I think you won't like. Helena Pierce. As administrator of New Haven, I am responsible for the well-being of its citizens. Is this the, uh... I'll buy this. Sanctuary? Yo, shotguns. Okay. Uh, New Haven. Helena Pierce, isn't this like the character from, uh... Oh, no, that's uh, Dr. Halsey, right. Ooh, more storage. Power to the people. It's Tannis. Ooh, bounties. Check on the TK Baja for Scooter. Ah, that's going back to the beginning, and I don't want to do that just yet. Power to the people. I'm wagging here. <laughs> I love it. That is fantastic. Yeet! They never saw me coming. You know why? I'm a ghost! I'm gonna use one more of these. I know this is theoretically wasting golden keys, but like, am I ever gonna use- th Oh my god! <laughs> just- <laughs> Just randomly get a hive mind? Okay. Sure. I'll take it. I don't know if that's good or not, but like... Oh, wait a minute, I have three, uh... I have three spots in my thing now! That's cool. I'm gonna replace that. Yep! Who else can't understand the Boston, a Boston accent? Oh, I can understand it very well. I don't know how the elephant gun is, but I'm hoping that it's just okay. Oh, it's Marcus. Marcus Munitions. We lost it's actual Marcus, not the, you know, Marcus Marcus. Can I get this up here? Nope, can't get it right there. I'm going to get some bounty stuff. Just in case. Oh, sup? Repair kit? Where's the repair kit? Oh. It's only right around the corner. Okay. Am I able to get it up here? Parkour. Okay, cool. Um, and now I need... Power to the people. That's over here. But why is it my job to do this crap? Why can't someone else, like, set the power up? Can I make this jump? Nope. Nope. Ah, oh, boo, I'm stuck now. Dude, parkouring Borderlands 1, very complicated. A lot harder in Borderlands 2. Didn't I already get this? I did. Okay. Now I gotta get up there. Oh, boy. 